You might be wondering what keeps the ball on the plate or how does it work and what is it good for? This video gives you the answers and helps you to build your own. First we need to know the secret to how it balances itself. A bike rider is basically using the same principle. He needs to be able to balance and rebalance himself constantly even in a case of a disturbance in order to keep riding. Now let's take a closer look at how he does that. The diagram shows the process which is a closed loop. One of the key components of the process are the sensors which are, among others, the eyes and inner ears. They detect the current position of the rider and deliver this information to the brain. The brain then checks whether it's balanced or not. If there is an error, it sends correction commands to the muscles to compensate for the faults. This goes on and on to maintain the perfect balance. The ball on plate is basically the same. Instead of eyes and ears, a touch screen detects the position of the ball on it and sends that information to a microcontroller, which corresponds to the brain in our biker example. The microcontroller compares the current position of the ball with the desired position and calculates the correction using a controlling algorithm. It then sends commands to the motors, which move the touch screen so the ball stays on the plate and does what we want it to do, like a circle or move to a certain point. Now let's take a look at the main components of the device. Well, thanks for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe or give a thumbs up. Salam.